Pots and pans should be packed in four or five cubic foot cartons. Before beginning to pack, obtain permission from your customer to use their table or work area and that it is properly protected with a furniture pad. Have clean use print available. Next, prepare your carton by placing crushed paper on the bottom as this will act as a cushion for the pots and pans. Up to three pots can be nested one inside the other. Wrap the first pot with two or three sheets of paper. Place the next smaller pot inside the first pot. Line this pot with two or three sheets of paper. Now that you have the pots nested together, take three sheets of paper and begin to cover the pots by taking one corner of the paper and pulling the paper over and covering the pots. Take the second corner and pull the paper over. Do the same for the third corner and finally the fourth corner. Use packing tape to keep the bundle together if needed. If the packing paper is not large enough to cover the piece, spread out the paper. Use two or three sheets. Use whatever is needed to cover the pots. Now that you have the nested pots completely covered, put them into the four or five cubic foot carton. Place them on their side. The lids that belong to those pots should be wrapped in paper and packed in the same carton as the pots they belong to. Start from the corner, wrap in diagonally and continually tucking in the overlapping edges. Lids can be wrapped as one or stacked one on top of the other. If the carton has a little space left before you seal it, use crushed paper to tighten it up. So that way there won't be any shifting or a possibility of the carton collapsing when the carton is being transported. When the carton is full, Add clean sheets of paper for sealing the carton. Tape the carton shut. And lastly, using a permanent marker, write the customer's name, order number, room, and contents on the carton.